Today we're going to be looking at... Yeah, that that kind of looks like... Uh... Yeah, that's what I thought. Today we're going to be looking at Little Wizard. And your job, as always, is to tell me, is this worth a buck? Of course, we actually, before that happens, we're going to have a better look at this figure. Little Wizard. Hmm. I don't know. I maybe it's just me, but there's something there's something that about this figure that reminds me of something. There was a movie. Wasn't there a movie? I think there was a movie about a kid with glasses. He had a broom and a wand. He went to school. He went to a wizard school. What was his name? I'm sure it's going to come to me. I don't know. I mean, I'm sure there's no there is no such thing. Um, but we're looking at Little Wizard. This fantastic detail on this guy. Package-wise, of course, we've got an amalgamation of things. We've got, it looks like some ice. We've got some stars. I mean, they've thrown everything on here. You've even got a witch there. Got a castle. Looks like a phoenix. We got a wizard down, a, an eight-bit wizard down below. There's definitely a lot going on with this package. Front-wise, there's a lot going on. On the back, nothing. It's imported from Edmonton, Alberta. Um, warning, also. Careful out there, anyone. Small parts, not for children under three. Under three. Keep this away. Made in China. So what we're going to do is we're going to open up the little wizard. And your job is going to tell me, is this worth a buck? Stay tuned. I remember the movie now. It was, it was Little Monsters. No, that's not it. I don't know. Maybe, maybe this is an original figure. At any rate, we've got ourselves Little Wizard. Detailing actually on him is really good. I mean, keeping in mind, this is a dollar toy. Kind of looks like something you would have got from uh, play school, like an actual play school toy. Um, his articulation, I mean, he's got articulation in the head. He's kind of got a rubbery head, kind of like an eraser head. Uh, you can move the arms. It's it's a rubbery plastic. Like there is there is give to the to the joints and everything else. Um, there is no articulation at all from anything else on this toy. It's just strictly head and arms. But uh, coloring is nice. It has a quality look to it. Like I, all joking aside, it does. I mean, it for what it is, the paint's pretty good. And uh, speaking of paint, I don't know if some of the paint on his hair is coming off. But. Uh, it does. It looks like a high-end toy, as you know, as silly as it sounds. It does look like something you would get from a, like a play school line. Um, his accessories. He comes with a broom, which I don't know how much help the broom's going to be. I guess that's where his, the jet propulsion comes out of is the opening at the bottom. Um, but you can put it in his hand. He also does come with a very long wand. It kind of goes up to his shoulder. We'll give that to him as well. And we've got ourselves the little wizard. He's got these really cool glasses. They don't look like they come off. I'm sure, if you got them off, they probably wouldn't go back on again. Very cool. Um, I, I don't know if you, you probably, being that these are rubbery, you could probably try to find a way to get... There we go. You can have him holding the broom if he wants to clean up and or you know fly. I mean, a boy wizard flying around on a broom that seems completely un that seems completely uh, far fetched. But little wizard. 
So let me know, guys. Little Wizard, is it worth a buck? It's completely original. I've never seen anything like this. A boy wizard in school with glasses? Completely original. So tell me, is the Little Wizard worth a buck? Let me know down below. And I'll see you guys next time. For a thousand videos, now that's dedication. It's more than a video, that's a creation that he is making. From experience, here he is. You're curious of what his appearance is. Serious, yet he makes it fun to watch. A lot of reviewers are delirious. Well, some get props. When the demand is hot, the spot's not a man to flop. Respects the fans who watch, couldn't guess the next random spot. The Spot Army is now taking over. This is our spot. Sitting on top, the Spot Army is now taking over. I bet you're confused. Check the reviews. The Spot Army is now taking over. This